Well, as domestically Boris Johnson has had his Queen's speech here, EU leaders have been meeting in Luxembourg, EU ministers that is, uh, and really there has been some sort of publicly at least some political will to try and get a deal done, but time is of course running out. We heard some warmer words from both sides, both the UK and European politicians towards the end of last week, uh, but really it seems that there, there are still some major stumbling blocks. Aside from the time a deal has to get done by the 17th or 18th of October, there's also the issue of the Northern Irish border, which is still and has been for the past three years the main stumbling block, the main sticking point. What we uh, understand now is that Boris Johnson is trying to compromise a bit uh, to try and say that the Northern Ireland will stay in the customs union with the UK, but that informally it will also remain in the European Union's customs union. Now, how that will work, the Europeans think that that's just going to get a bit too messy. So uh, plenty of details to still iron out. But once Boris Johnson does get a deal, that's a huge, huge if. He then has to come here at the weekend on the 19th of October, where a special uh, session of parliament will be held to try and convince MPs to back the deal or to back Britain leaving without a deal, uh, what's known as a no deal Brexit, which uh, as has been well documented there isn't much support here in Parliament so it's going to be a long and troubling week we've heard many times that it's going to be a crunch week for Brexit but this really looks like this could be one here in London back to you